The Carroll School, built in 1929, was added to the National Register of Historic Places earlier this month. Though the small, quaint white building has been given the status of an official historic landmark in York County, some residents were not even aware of the history that rested at their back doorstep. Rock Hill resident Robin Clyburn lives just 15 minutes away from the landmark, a somewhat unknown and untold story seeing to itself just miles off McConnell's Highway. I've seen the building a few times, but I never really knew the story behind it. The building served as a school for African American students from the time it was built until it closed its doors in 1954. <laughs> and it now functions as a field trip destination in order to have students learn about history relative to the area, such as the Great Depression and how students learned and lived during the early 1900s. Rock Hill native and parent Cheryl Stowe has a daughter that has attended one of the field trips. Stowe says the experience changes the way students look at education. And I think it was a really good learning experience for them to see just how far education has come and the advantages that they have now and the fact that you know everybody gets to go to the better schools now. They're not segregated. The Carroll School now officially stands as a reminder of an era that has passed but will not be forgotten. For this little white schoolhouse, the lessons are just beginning all over again. Tiffany Miller, the Family Report.